Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to the 10th of August. It's already 62 degrees out here. I don't know what it's supposed to be like today. I'm thinking probably pretty nice. Look at the moon up there. Heck yeah. Old Sparky out here hanging out. What's going on, old Spackles, huh? You're such a good boy. He's my little buddy at night. He comes and hangs with me all night long. And at some point, he bails out. Get up in the morning, he's gone. Probably because mama gets up in the middle of the night and he goes, I'm gonna go hang with her. She gives out things. <laughs> anyway, welcome to Monday. Start of a new week. We haven't seen our our little deers here last part of last week. Last part of last week. <laughs> yeah, it must have changed your schedule, but we've seen other other ones in different spots. Woman, if there was ever a day to play hooky, today was that day. I'm thinking after yesterday, we need to do way more rides. Man, I got up this morning, I'm like, no, oh, it's a work day. Look at this. This is riding weather, not working weather. Made it to Vancouver safe and sound, Mama. Yeah, I can still see the moon. Oh, yeah. She's still hanging out up there. Yeah. That's a good thing. It's if that ever disappears, all of a sudden, we're in trouble. <laughs> we would be in trouble. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, you have yourself a wonderful Monday. You too. Have a happy And I'll see you as I come up and down. Okay. All right. Love to see you. Bye. I love you. <laughs> bye, bye, now. bye. Now, this is how you start off a Monday. A first service and a sway bar install. That's cool. A BRP approved and provided sway bar. Not one. Well, I'll we'll just leave that alone. So, uh, riding a BMW R1250 RT now. All I got to say is smart man and congratulations. I'm here to tell you. Putting this, that sway bar in this thing is literally a pain in the butt. I mean, a huge pain in the butt. <laughs> My son's put them in before. I don't. I don't think he cried enough or something. Jeez, what a pain in the butt! All right, let me get back at her. Let's go take a Riker around the block. It's cool they have completely kitted this thing out. Um, it's got the, well now I got the sway bar, the shield, the um, comfort seats, all the bells and whistles. Heck yeah. Why wouldn't you? Oh man, it feels good to plop my little body on something. That nice adjustable shield. I love that thing. It's so small, but it's so functional. Oh, and they got the uh, deflectors. They added the deflectors to it. They come with the uh, hand guards, but not the wind deflectors. Man, do those things work good in the winter. The difference is absolutely night and day. Man, these premium seats are, uh, dude, they make all the difference in the world. Used to being on the, the little sponge seat, you know, and, you know, when you first sit on them, you go, oh, that's pretty comfortable. Until you sit on one of these. These things are so comfortable, I joke around saying, Mustang must be making these things for, for a Can-Am. I think that makes more noise than just letting the wind blow in. If you guys are getting wind noise, I apologize. Oh, 
I'm all kinds in a weird sequence with the lights, aren't I? I'm in the catch me mode. These records are so fun. want to turn uh, one too early. It's got the old hog all tied down, covered up today. That's all right. If it's anything here like it is up north, having them foggy, dewy mornings and you wake up in the morning and everything's wet. It ain't getting no rain, it's just wet. <laughs> oh, there's loose. There's loose gravel there. You just can't see it. I know Rikers don't have belts or nothing like that, but they can still fling them up and they'll stick to things, you know? Nothing like in there wiping along and all of a sudden you catch one of those tarred rocks that's flipped up, stuck to something. The thing's going to be sharp. Man. There's more roads. Look, that one's been done. Man, they've taken all my roads away. Hope they don't get me boxed into a corner and I have to revert, reverse my way out. This is the back side of the one I was just looking at over there by the park. Building them houses, boy. Some of these old houses are cool as heck. Look at that big old thing. I don't think that's very old either, but. Really nice. I like it when the house is so big you can get lost. You can literally be on the other side of the house and you can't even call out to someone on the other end, you know. I can scream loud enough Kelly can hear me anywhere in our house. She's small. Are you guys soaking in all the views? <laughs> I hope so because I sure ain't much talkative. Got a whole lot to say actually. I, uh, Kelly did a quick little look and the Mustang Super Tour seat is uh, still holding the August 18th um, delivery, not delivery, but uh, the vendor is going to receive them. That's a couple, three days from there. I keep hoping it'll show up early, but you know, Mustang, among many, many other people, you know, got uh, wrapped up in all this mess. And they got, they got behind themselves. Well, that's a bad time to get behind because most places in the, in the states, you know, during their individual downtimes, you know, people were able to ride rec recreationally like on motorcycles and stuff so you get them people that go I got plenty of time to go ride I need to get me a comfortable Mustang seat 
I wonder how much overhead they had, you know, when this all happened. How long they were able to uh, to go before they ran out of stock. Or were they able, uh, I think they were just shut down. They probably weren't even able to move out the stock they had. Man, what a mess. If you go to their website, they still pop up the thing saying that Due to the virus, we have some delays, but they're they're building away. One thing's for sure, it'll be a nice fresh seat. <laughs> I just hope they're not panic building or anything like that. And, uh, doing less than, but well, my other one was uh, was back ordered as well, the standard tour. And uh, she was nothing shy of perfect. Good companies wouldn't allow hasty, shoddy work to happen. Word of mouth nowadays, you know, if you do something shoddy, that gets out quick. Oh, somebody's keeping track of that dog. Oh, <laughs> right there. Worldwide Services, UPS. You go in, let this thing idle for for a little bit, and uh, double check the oil. <laughs> I've done about 15 false starts today. About ready to go. See myself an automobile and have to stop. roaming around all over down here all righty well, thanks for coming along on a rip on a 2019 Riker rally a very very nice Riker rally I think it's kitted out with the addition which I never notice them things anyway unless it's on a Spider, I can cut the back end loose on them. Didn't do anything weird, so I would say it's good, and I think I'm too close. Oh, look at that, I just made it. All right, I'm gonna bounce. Man, is that stunning or what? I love that color on these things. Kind of reminds me of the asphalt gray on the, on the spiders, but it, in a way really cool the boxers man well as you might guess from the view from the truck we're not in Vancouver anymore not and that beautiful people. horse is out there Woo, birdies anyway we're moseying our way towards the house this beautiful beautiful evening sure is peaceful when you get off that freeway and you go yep this is where home is, out here in the country. People go, how do you drive that far? Gladly, every day, gladly. Yeah, we are so far removed from the rat race out here. Very nice. <laughs> well, hello there, YouTube. Sometimes that little woman's a little goofy before we get these things started. Yeah. Man, what? It is cool. I don't know what it's cooled off to. But it feels good. Probably mid to lower 70s. Feels very, very comfortable out here. It's like no humidity. It's a nice little breeze. It feels good. Not, oh, I was about to say not a cloud in the sky. There's some back, back over there a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> I'm riding that Riker today. Man, I, I was thinking when I got back, I said, did I even talk during that video? I don't know. I was just having one of those peaceful moments of riding that Riker. Thinking how much I enjoy those things. 
they don't make the best touring bikes, but people definitely, and I do mean definitely tour on them. They are fun. Yeah. They're lots of fun. They are crazy fun. But then, you know, people that, you know, haven't been around the spiders or ridden those reverse trike type bikes, the Riker may, may seem like a handful to you, but it's, it's like a, it's like a spider that's really super, super, super playful. Mm -hmm. Not really comfortable going down the freeway or anything like that because they're small, you know, but crazy, spunky, and fun. I was thinking about how nice that thing was. And it, that that one, I don't think I've met this, <laughs> these people. Annie or Sasha. But, uh, I mean, they have that thing set up just like we had ours set up. So I just was having this crazy flashback moment. I was thinking about going out there playing in the snow that one day and how much fun them Rikers are. are. I come back, I'm going, well, I think the whole time through that thing and I even talk. I'm not even sure. <laughs> I don't know. You guys know by the time you got here. I haven't looked at any of that footage. So we will see. Yeah, I don't ever. I, I literally look at nothing until the end of the day. <laughs> they had such, Them two that are Sasha just thing. having too much fun. <laughs> they go play now. Them two absolutely love each other. Yep. It's funny how that we end up with these pairs, you know, uh, Abby and Madison... You know, sisters from the same litter. Sasha and Annie. Then you got Danny and Sparky that are like they're scattered litter, all yeah, over they're you. They're a litter apart, but they definitely just go everywhere. Yeah, those together. two play a lot too. And then um, it's weird. Uh, Abby and Sparky will go a little adventuring. And then it's Danny and Abby. Abby's like the, I'll show you the ropes through the yeah, woods. Yeah, I'll show you all the secret spots. Yeah, I'll show you all the secret squirrel stuff. Yeah. And then whoever she takes, they come back with muddy nose and then found a mole. Yeah. And they leave their little mole surprises out here every yeah, once in a while. Yeah, I brought you a present. Yeah. He goes, no more moles. In we have literally no moles in yeah, our yard. we used to. Yeah. yeah. And it started with Jules. Yeah. Right? Yeah, Jules taught. Um, trouble. trouble and then trouble taught Abby yeah. and Madison. As long as these dogs are around, you go around moles everywhere. Ain't no moles in our area. Nope. <laughs> they don't last very long. Well, anyway, we better we're roll. gonna call it on that. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Tuesday or Wednesday. Heck yeah. All right. We will see you in the morning. Hope you enjoyed. Whatever I came up with uh, up to yep. this point. <laughs> See you in the morning. Bye. Thanks for watching now. Bye-bye.